Welcome to learning Japanese again today. The kanji that we learn today. We will learn the kanji manabu. This kanji means study, learning, or sign. And this kanji have the onyomi reading like gaku. Gaku. And the kungyumi reading is read like mana, manabu, manabu. The kanji of manabu or kaku is mean learning or study or sign. So every time we talk about learn, for example, the school, right, the, the school or the sign or the scientist. We will use this kanji to represent the meaning of studying, learning, or science or scientists. Kakuse, kakuse, kakuse is mean student. I see here we have the uh, example like this. Ototo wa mada chukakuse des. Ototo wa mada chukakuse des. Is mean my younger brother is still a middle school student. My younger brother is still a middle school student. As in here, kaku kaku is mean learn or study something. So, we just say it means uh, the person, right, or the life. So, when we put uh, the kanji of kaku, we just say it means uh, some, somebody that, or something that have a life, learn, learn something. So, in here they say uh, student. But kaku uh, say just means student. But in this sentence, we see that chu kaku say chu is mean a uh, middle school. Middle chu is mean uh, in the middle. So when you put the meaning that a uh, middle with the uh, the noun that kaku say right kaku say means student. So it's mean that the student in the middle, that's mean the middle school student. So uh, uh, in this, uh, you can put uh, in from of uh, the kakuse like uh, even to say about the uh, upper secondary school student can say uh, ko kakuse, right? Chu kakuse. Chu is mean middle, ko is mean higher, higher or high school student. So you can say ko kakuse is mean high school student. And when you want to say about uh, primary school, you can say sho kakuse. Sho kakuse is mean primary school. Sho is mean the beginner, the beginner, right? Or the beginning of uh, something, so it means uh, primary primary school student. It's not middle school student. And when you were to say about the uh, high school student, it means ko kakuse. And in here we have the new word like ototo. Ototo is mean younger brother. So in here they have. Ototo wa mada chukakuse desu. It means my younger brother is still a middle school student. So every time when you learn the Japanese, you when you learn one kanji, you should know uh, how to create the compound, the compound word by using the kanji. Are you see here we have the word kakuse, right? You just remember only the kanji. You you cannot uh learn Japanese faster so you don't know how to create the word how to create a sentence so that is difficult for you to remember 
Japanese kanji. So the, the easy way to learn Japanese kanji, you have to know how to create the com the compound now by using that kanji. For example, you can say gaku se, right? Gaku is from the kanji of today we learning gaku or manabu. This means uh, learning or studying. But the first, you sh you should know uh, the on yumi reading and the kun yumi reading, such as gaku is mean on yumi reading, and uh, kun yumi reading like manabu, right? Is mean learn, and the meaning too is is really important. Sometimes you just see the kanji, but you don't know how to read, but you know the meaning so that you can guess that that kanji mean like this. So another kanji I'm going to compound now. In here we have like this. Gakko. Gakko. Gakko is mean school. And in here we have the uh, sentence like Tanaka-san no gakko wa doko desu ka? Tanaka san no gakko wa doko desu ka? Which means, where is the Tanaka san school? Watashi no gakko wa daikaku no mae ni arimasu. Which means, my school is in front of the university. Right, so when you want to explain something, you should know the place that near your school. For example, in front of the university or near the university. So you can say, Watashi no kakko wa daikaku no chikaku ni arimasu. Watashi no kakko wa daikaku no chikaku ni arimasu. Which means, my school is near the university something like this so this is about how to create a sentence by using kakko kakko is means school right anata no kakko wa doko desu ka or you can say susuki san no kakko wa doko desu ka which means where is susuki san school susuki san no kakko wa toshokan no chikaku ni arimasu. Susuki san no kakko wa toshokan no chikaku ni arimasu. Which means Susuki san school is near the library. Toshokan is mean library. So the next 